the Camry is a mainstay of the midsize sedan segment, which has been losing both entries and sales in recent years as the world has embraced SUVs. Nevertheless, while the market has changed the Camry has continued to top the sales charts as the number one selling passenger cars, a spot it's held for the past 20 years. It has a well-earned reputation reliability, and it offers a hybridized version that returns exceptional fuel economy. The current generation of the Camry borders on stylish, especially when optioned with the nightshade package which adds bronze wheels for 2023 or the sporty-looking TRD trim. And while many of the Camry's rivals, such as the Honda Accord and the Hyundai Sonata, have moved to four-cylinder lineups, Toyota's midsize sedan can still be had with an optional 301 horsepower V6. While it's far from an exciting car to drive, its safety features, economical engines, and spacious interior make it a competent and easy to live with daily driver. What's new for 2023? For 2023, the SE trim's optional nightshade package adds black headlight and taillight trim to match the black front grille, rear spoiler, mirror caps, and badges. The nightshade also gains matte bronze 19-inch wheels that, surprisingly, don't look out of place on it. You can add the package to midnight black, white, or reservoir blue, a new color. The rest of the Camry lineup gets more driver assistance technology, including automatic high beams and a forward-facing camera that can read certain road signs and show them on the digital display. We'd select the XLE Hybrid, because we think it is the trim that best reflects what the Camry is best at, being an easy-going family sedan with almost Lexus accommodations. Driven gently, it delivers excellent fuel economy. It rides well, steers accurately, and its standard leather interior is handsome, roomy, and well-equipped. The standard four-cylinder engine pairs with a silky eight-speed automatic, but its acceleration numbers are disappointing. A less powerful version of that engine works with a battery and two electric motors to power the Camry Hybrid, which is no more exciting to drive than the base powertrain. The real gem of this lineup is the velvety 301 horsepower V6 that's available on the XLE and XSE models as well as the TRD variant. We're also happy to say that we no longer hate driving the Camry. It has a controlled ride and surprisingly responsive handling. The steering is pleasantly weighted and feels substantial when cornering and light when maneuvering in parking lots. We found the Camry's brake pedal responsive and not too soft, even in the hybrid, in which it must meld friction with regenerative braking. We've driven the Camry in both top-level XLE guys and in its more plebeian SE trim. Both are spacious and comfortable, and the XLE is downright luxurious. However, there's a serious gap in material quality between the entry-level models and the more expensive versions, and the center section of the dashboard left some of us cold with its uninspired design. The Camry is a large sedan, and there's plenty of cargo space and interior storage in both its trunk and in its cabin with the rear seat folded. It's not the best in every storage category, but overall, it's thoroughly competitive. Toyota relocated the Camry Hybrid's battery from the trunk to beneath the rear seats, so hybrid owners don't have to sacrifice carrying capacity for the extra MPG. Toyota's touchscreen infotainment system, called Intune 3.0 is standard across the Camry lineup, with an enhanced version available as an option. Intune has loads of features and responded reasonably well to user inputs in our tests, and Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility are standard. We continue to applaud Toyota's decision to make driver assistance technology standard on all Camry models. Standard key safety features include Forward collision warning and automated emergency braking Lane departure warning and lane keeping assist Adaptive cruise control Thank you for watching. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel.